Hey guys, this is Down Phoenix, and I have some really exciting stuff to share with you guys today. This is just crazy. This is really crazy. You're not even going to believe what I got here, people. And it was like for basically nothing out of pocket, which is insane. I know it sounds really insane, but hear me out. Let me explain what's going on. I got two new things recently. The first one is a PS4 Pro, which is just insane. I mean, this thing is magnificent. I actually got it hooked up right there, right now. And uh, the other thing that goes along with it is a PlayStation VR, which, as you guys might have seen, I've been doing some VR streams, and we're probably going to do one after I film this video. Uh, both of these things are great and fantastic, and you might be wondering, well, how did I get that with basically no out-of-pocket cost? I discovered with a recent GameStop promotion uh, recently they had probably the best trade bonus I've ever seen them offer. At least as far as I can remember. They were offering when you traded six or more games a 60% trade bonus. And that's on top of getting your normal 10% if you're a Power Pro member. So you got 70%. So for example, if a game was worth 10 bucks, you actually got 17. 20, 34. You get the idea. And there were some freaking crazy promotions that they had with this year. I've got a whole mother load of receipts from GameStop that kind of chronicles the events as they unfolded here. And I did want to show you guys a little bit of that because this trade bonus was insane. It started off first with me just taking some games that I didn't want and kind of looking at trade values and what GameStop was offering versus what I could get on eBay, you know, just to see what kind of difference there was. If the difference was close enough, I decided, well, I'll just go ahead and take it in GameStop for that trade bonus. And I was surprised at how much I was actually getting from these trade bonuses. It was insane. In some cases, I was getting more than what they sold the game for, which is just mind-blowing, honestly. You know, it really is. Just to give you some examples, Mario Kart 8 Deluxe, $59.50 trade bonus. GameStop sells that game to pro members for $49.49. And I've got some more examples here. Super Smash Bros. for the 3DS, $42.50. Kirby Planet Robobit, $42.50. Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask, all for the 3DS, $42.50. None of these games are over $40 brand new. So you can only imagine some of the craziness. $51 for 1-2 Switch, $42.50 for Binding of Isaac Afterbirth. Just insane trade bonuses. And just to kind of give you guys an idea of where all of this went, they did a limited time offer where they did a buy two get one free from July 1st to 4th. And of course, when you can put two and two together, you can do some crazy ass stuff. Like, for example, how I spent $197.96 in games doing the buy two, get one free, and turning that into roughly $270 in trading credit. That was before I even realized where the money pot was, which is the 3DS games, because you were able to buy those for much cheaper, and the trade values were not as much, but they were pretty damn close. I was paying for maybe... $130, $140 in trade credit, getting $240 in trade credit, trading 3DS games. I mean, this was just insane. I mean, it was pretty much the great GameStop heist of 2017. A lot of people I know were also able to take advantage of these excellent trade offers that probably were never seen before, and I'm sure never seen again, because GameStop eventually did catch on to what was going on, and on July 4th, they tanked their trade values, which did screw me over just a little bit. I ended up not getting as much as I originally planned on getting for the promotion, but it still didn't stop me from getting these two items, which is just awesome. I know some people are probably going to be in the comments like, ooh, that's fraudulent, or how dare you screw over GameStop, and all this other stuff. 
But then in the same light, these people will also go on rants and talk about how GameStop is such a shitty company, and they treat their employees like shit, and they offer nothing for trade bonuses, and all this other stuff, you know. So they're hypocrites, and if you're one of those people, you know where to go. Uh, but anyways, I just wanted to kind of share this really cool moment with you guys. I've never really been a GameStop hater. You know, I've always... Um, had a good time overall with GameStop. Now, that's not to say that there haven't been bad moments, but, you know, this was an awesome thing to happen, and it is their fault, ultimately, that they let it happen, because they should have set up their system to where it can't be gamed. So you can't get mad at people like me and several others that did game the system, because we did our research. So maybe that's what they were referring to when they were talking about power to the players. The people that know how to utilize those trade bonuses. You guys know that I'm a GameStop fan. I've uploaded videos before doing GameStop hunting videos. Doing GameStop trade bonus videos and things like that. So this is nothing new. But of course we're going to get those hater hypocrites in here. You know, unless you are a truly devoted GameStop fan that has stock invested in the company, you know where to go. But thank you guys for watching, and until then, down Phoenix out.